matters. Well, of course it matters. You've got to give your evidence today. Paddy's always changed your mind. Oh, I don't know. Because she hates me. Because she never meant to do it in the first place. Right. Well, it's more important that you go in to change their minds. You've got to give your side of the story. That's the last thing and then it's the verdict. Mm. I love you, Debbie. It's you that's keeping me going. You know that, don't you? I'll go get dressed. I don't want to come. I hate it, everyone saying horrible things about you, lying all the time. I don't have to listen to it anymore. You and me both, love. But, you know, if you don't come, it might be the last time. You'll be home this afternoon. It'll all be over by then. And what if... What if they find me guilty? They won't. Won't they? No. Perhaps it's best if you don't come anyway. I'll tell you what, go to Lisa's and tell her I asked her to keep an eye on you. Just till I get back. Will you be all right in your own, cos if not, I'll come. Debbie, babe, I'll be fine. It's only for a few more hours. It'll soon be over. Yeah. Look, I'll wait for you over here, yeah? Look out for you coming back. OK. Oh, God, look then. I've been waiting. Did you go back today? Uh, yeah. I mean, Eric did give me the day off, but I thought, well, I didn't want to go back after yesterday, what with Zoe laying into charity, ripping her apart. It's not going well. No, not very. Mind you, it's Debbie I feel sorry for having to go back in after that, but it is Charity's big day. I mean, she's giving her evidence and maybe there's the verdict. Oh, it's a lot for a young girl to carry. I was so involved at the beginning. Oh, yeah. You were the one that stood by her and there was me telling you not to. No, I'm not there at all. Oh, love. Oh, no. I didn't mean... Nobody's asking you to do things that you can't do. No, that was the cause, you know. Start the trouble. Me and Tricia. I know, love. Well, Zach will be there. She won't be on her own. You don't think she'll get off, do you? I honestly don't know, love. I mean, it just depends how the day goes. Do you still think she did it? Oh, I've no idea anymore. But I hope she does get off for Debbie's sake. You all right? Yeah, I'm waiting for my mum. She's due back soon. Last day of the trial today, isn't it? Yeah. She'll get off, I know she will. Debbie, you can't be sure of that. Yeah, I can. She didn't do it. <laughs> Look, there are, there are two possible outcomes to this trial. You need to be prepared for both of them, including the one in which your mum is found guilty. Oh, get lost. Look, you could always... And don't tell me I should be praying. I wasn't going to. Although it's not a bad idea, but only if you pray for justice, not for magic. It'd be justice if my mum got off. Look, I was only going to suggest that you wait somewhere indoors. It's very early. They're not going to reach a verdict for quite a while. And it is cold, isn't it? Debbie, love. Oh, you look half frozen. Let me make you a mug of tea. No, I'm, I'm all right. Marlon went to the court. Suddenly felt he wanted to be there. Well, didn't you? Uh, no, I didn't want to. No, love. Well, somebody's got to be here to fill the troops' bellies when they get back. Now, come on, you sit down. No, I, I said I'd meet my mum on the corner only. That weird vicar told me it was too early. Oh, well, he's right, it is. Now, you sit down. I am going to give you a mug of tea, whether you like it or not. Right, but then I'm going to go and meet her. So, what do you think now, then? I think she didn't do it. Oh, you men. You always suck us for a pretty blonde putting on an act. You weren't even party to it, so if I were you, I'd keep your trap shut. How do you think I did, then? Really? You did great, Charity. Did all right. I'm just not sure it's enough to repair yesterday's damage. Look! I 
don't believe it. As if she hasn't done him enough harm. Well, he's back for more. And Trisha not yet cold in her grave. She is his cousin, you silly woman. He probably believes she's innocent like I do. I mean, time. I just suddenly thought I, I could not be here for this. Not after all. We, even though I... Well, well, thanks for coming. Look at that. How's Debbie? Is she all right? I thought she was here. No, she couldn't face it. I told her to go to your ceilings. No sign of up to when I left. Oh, I need to phone her. Do you want to go somewhere private? We've plenty of time. It'll take ages to make up the mind. All parties in the case of charity tape, please attend court number three. Is that for the verdict? It must be, yeah. A bit quick, isn't it? Yeah. It's not a good sign, is it? No. Will the foreman please stand? Please confine yourself to answering my first question, yes or no. Has the jury reached a verdict on which you all agree? Yes. Do you find the defendant, Charity Tate, guilty or not guilty of murder? Guilty. Is that the verdict of you all? It is. Do sit down. In the light of what representations have been made by your advocate, I shall forward to the Home Secretary a recommendation of tariff. As you are aware, there is only one sentence I can impose, and that is life imprisonment. <laughs> Take her down. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no. 